Weirdo Benjo. Every now and then I'll see a game and immediately know that I want to play it and record it for the channel. This is one of those games. This is No More Rainbows from... Uh, shut up! Stupid alarm! From Squido. I think they're called Squido, the development team. And this is basically, in a nutshell, in the most simplified way, Gorilla Tag, but single player. Um, which I am all for, because I'm, one, put my claws up, not very good at Gorilla Tag, and two, I'm not particularly keen on spending the time in Gorilla Tag with all the squeaky people making squeaky, loud, childish noises. So I get to do that in here on my own and not have to put up with that, which is quite nice. Now this is a VR platformer. Can I open this? No? Can I? <coughs> nope, can't go in there. A VR platformer where you play it as some kind of furry creature from hell and you have to walk and run around with the same kind of locomotion principles as Gorilla Tag. So you swing your physical arms to get around. And I I love it as a concept. I loved it in Gorilla Tag. But as I say, I just couldn't put up with the children. Uh, long jumps. Swing both arms down. Huh. I'd actually probably say this is a game that doesn't need tutorials because as soon as you start moving, it just makes sense to you. Really easy to pick up and play. Huh. Turn with your... Ah! Okay, I went into the lava, that wasn't great. Turn with your body, physically, or I can turn with smooth turning on the right stick and snap turning on the left stick, which is a really odd combination of controls I haven't seen before. I've never seen a game that kind of has both styles of turning, um, but I'm not complaining. Now, I think when the game really gets into it, this is a proper platformer. Um, I've seen the devs kind of reference Super Meat Boy, which is one of my favourite games of all time. I do have a Super Meat Boy tattoo. Big, big, big fan of that game. Whee! Um, so I am expecting really good things here. What did that say? Climb. Press triggers to use your claws. And climb Hellstone by using claws one hand at a time. Okay. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that feels good. Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. Right, brilliant. And again. Oh. <laughs> you know when you encounter a VR mechanic that just works? Yeah, that is sweet. Uh, now, I am recording on the PC version today. Um, because I couldn't get SideQuest to install the native Quest version for some bizarre reason. But there is a native Quest version um, if you want to give that a go. And you can get the beta from SideQuest. I hate flowers. They're the worst. Rotate left hand to look inside your hand and see how many souls you've collected. None. Is that a soul? Can I have it? What is that? It's like a little egg person. Hello. It's a little Humpty Dumpty fella. Hello. That is a... Uh, that's just an adorable egg creature. Can I, like... Oh! Oh! Oh, Jesus! Oh, no! Ah! Oh my god, it's brain! Oh, okay. That was hyper violent. I wasn't expecting that hyper violence. Am I going to ruin these little egg creatures' day? Like, turning up to their picnic. I've got a soul. I need ten souls. Hey, guys! How you going? Oh my god. Shut up, music. Oi, you. Come here. Come here, little fella. Oh. Oh, I immediately love this. Oh, I missed him. Up. Okay. He's got a little bum. Look at his little bum. Oh my god, he's got a little bum. Did I throw them too? Okay, I still get the... I thought I wasn't going to get the soul for a second. Oh, this is so good. This demo is free on Steam currently as part of the Steam Next Fest. So you can come and check this out if it looks like your cup of tea. Oh, look at them. They don't know what's, they don't know what's coming. Oh. Oh, they just exploded. Oh, they left a little nice little hat. Can I wear it? Oh, that's a shame. I can't wear the hat. Let's get that one on the swing. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, there's a little bird there. Oh, oh, 
I think the bird's dead. Yeah, bird's dead. That's, you know, a shame. Balloon's flown away. I'm coming for you, little fella. Oh! Oh, we died together. That's fine. He's having a barbecue. Treating himself to a lovely little barbecue. What are you cooking? What are you cooking? Not cooking anything yet. Open the portal by collecting bubble boy souls and breaking portal crystals. Oh, they're bubbles, not... Um, not eggs. No more barbecue for you. Hey, what do you think about that? <laughs> I feel so bad, but it's so funny. <laughs> and then it opens. Oh, this is so smart! Feels like something Devolver would uh, publish. It's got that kind of hue. What is that? What is going on here? Uh, oh, I've got no arms. Oh, she's sending her children to die. That's fine by me. Oh, there she is. There's the big egg lady. And she's got a nice rainbow portal. The game kind of reminds me of something. I'm not sure what it is. Like, it's visual style. I'm not entirely sure what it is. Hello. Hello, queen. Or king. Egg. Where are you going? World 1. Okay, they've run off into World 1. Now, I think because this is only the beta, there's, um, I think, only three worlds to play. I could be wrong. Let's go into World 1. It looks nice and colourful. Oh, that's very colourful. Ah, come here. Get back here. Okay, they, they went through that portal there, but I can't go through that. Oh, this is so lovely. Right, let's try and get some platforming practice in. Okay, I'm going to try and get on top of that tree. Right, off we go. One, two, three. Whoa. Piss. <laughs> the visuals are so nice. Like, this this portal looks great. Super sparkly and colourful. It looks a little bit like my jumper. I was going to use my green screen today, by the way, but then I realised this jumper is uh, just covered in green bits, and it would not fare well. There we go. Right. Top of the tree. Zero out of a hundred. That is a lot of tiny egg people to kill. Hello, boys. And girls. Thank you. Ah, oh, take that. Can I have that? Oh, smashed it. Hello there. Having a lovely little picnic? Yeah, I thought so. Come here, you. Guess what? Oh! Oh, I've gone red. I'm on like a murder spree. What's that about? What's going on? I mean, like overdrive mode. <laughs> Level one. Look at this. Ten, ten dudes and three unicorns. I think there's still stuff for me to find in here, so I'm not going to go through that portal. What is that? It's that big bucket of sweeties. I don't like sweeties. That's a lie. I do like sweeties. I like sweeties a lot. All right, come here, you. <sighs> Okay, we're going to go see your friend. Hello, fella. Ah, take that. Uh, pick up the blue thing. Throw the blue thing. Berries. I can throw these berries. Yeah, I can. Right. Bugger. Bugger. Nope. <laughs> I'm so bad at throwing things in VR. Let's get a bit closer. Not too close. Oh, my God. Aim. Throw. Take that, you shit. Hello, you little sausage. There we go. Do you want a berry? Nice. I bet you enjoyed that. Right, up there. We can climb that wall. That's a spiky wall. Okay. I like the climbing a lot. Come here, you. Get over there. Oh, everyone needs to come download this. If you've got a VR headset, come and check this out. Especially if you liked Gorilla Tag. Because this is that in terms of its mechanics, but it's condensed into a really nice single player experience. Proper. Oh, I broke the fence. <laughs> I'm excited whenever something breaks in this world. That's just lovely to me. Oh, you're painting a picture. That is a lovely picture. It would be a shame if a monster came up behind you and put his fingers up your bum. Yeah, sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> what a wonderful game. Come here, you. 
This video is just going to be a compilation of me smashing these eggs. Just non-stop egg smashing. Hey! Hey you! Guess what? You're dead. There needs to be more VR games where you get to play as a monster. There aren't enough. Where, I mean, where's my, like, proper Godzilla simulator, eh? Where's the game that lets me actually feel like a 200-foot-tall lizard terrorizing through, like, New York? I would love that so much. Can I fly? Oh, I can fly! That's so nice. Yeah. Oh, nearly. You live to see another couple of seconds. Oh, a few more. Hello. Hello, son. How you going? Come on. Come with me. Going for a little fly. Whee! What is that one doing over there? He's singing a little song. He's playing a guitar. Hello. What are you playing? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Oh, there's a shiny flying one up there. Hello. 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 Ugh. It's a Superman one. With a little bum. Look at that. Honestly, I love their faces. I love their pained expressions as they know they're going to die. Like, look at him. His futile little legs and arms. Shh, it's okay. You go into a better place. And then when you let them go, they explode. But then where's their head gone? There we go, look. You can look inside their head. I think they might actually be, like, jawbreakers? Gobstoppers? I mean, they look like they have the internals of a gobstopper. Right, let's go in here, because I think this is an actual level with things to do. In we go. Okay, this is an actual level. I've got ten to find. Let's do it. Let's just rain hell down on these... Oh, I missed him. On these stupid little egg people. Hello. Ten of you to find. Where are your friends? Come here, you. Right, you're going through the flower pot. Oh! I died. Was it worth it? Yeah, it probably was. I don't really see any penalty for dying. Um... You die and that's it, you just come back. It's kind of quite relaxed in that regard. Oh, there's a big one up there. What was that? Oh, what is up the top here? Oh, what is that? What is this? Oh! Yeah, they're definitely jawbreakers. Look at that. That is the internals of a gobstopper or a jawbreaker. I used to eat them all the time. Well, it would take me like a month to eat one, but I loved them when I did have them. Oh, there's a summoning circle. Is that a checkpoint, or do I have to put something in it? Nope, just just death. Just more death. Must be a checkpoint. I'd quite like to see how this game could take uh, kind of a life of its own and become a bit of a speed running. Oh, exercise. I mean, I imagine some VR players oh, would be able to really gel with these mechanics and um, whip through these levels super fast whilst also killing all the little leggy people. I'd quite like to see that, actually. I mean, I'm really only killing them with my right hand, because it's my dominant hand, but it's... Uh, I imagine some people <laughs> that are a little bit more ambidextrous would be great at this. Hey! Come here. All right, let's get rid of this unicorn. Hey! <laughs> it feels really nice to do stuff like that. I mean, obviously, I feel like a horrible monster, but also kind of just awesome. You and your stupid little hat. I actually quite liked his hat. No sweets for you guys. Especially not you. What the hell is that? What in the hell is that? Is that actually a person? Yeah, it is. I've got a happy little face. You all right? Yeah? Oh! I did it. Oh my god, look, to get the gold star. 40 seconds, and it took me 3 minutes 40. See what I mean about speedrunners? It ain't me, but someone will be able to do that, and then some. Look, there's like advanced maneuvers for better players. You can bounce off the walls. You could be like, bong, and then, oh, I can't do it because I'm terrible. <gasps> Jesus! But yeah, you could bounce off that one, onto that one, and skip this whole section. Very cool. I like that a lot. 
As a huge fan of Super Meat Boy and someone who grew up playing games like Banjo Kazooie and absolutely loving the collectathon style platform gameplay, this gets a huge two thumbs up from me. No More Rainbows is a lot of fun and yeah, I just just come and give it a go yourself. Super colourful, super ridiculous humour and just really well made from a small dev team and we should be supporting our small VR dev teams. I really like this. Come and check it out. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please do leave a like, leave a comment and hit subscribe. And I'll see you soon for another one. Take care, guys. See you later.